So ever since I acquired this turntable, I it's been mostly used for parts. Um, the original motor shit the bed. And on another record player I had, and I gave it to a friend, and he found a better one he liked, so he gave me his, the one I gave him back, except the one he bought had a broken needle, so I took the one off of the player that I let him have, which he gave back to me, and put on that record player, and then I took the needle from this record player, because this one's, like I said, more for parts, really, it's not, I have to use a completely separate power source for the turntable with the replaced motor, and um, I used the needle from this one on the other one, and then I took the broken needle, which you see here, and I opened it up and glued, or should I say super glued, everything back in inside the needle cartridge in place, and I just hooked the needle back on to this one, and for being a broken needle, it sounds a lot better now. Let's see here. And yeah, so, and uh, this is where the original motor sat, and uh, that one shut the bed, so I put in a new motor, and as you can see, there's a red wire and a black one somewhere, there it is, that's just dangling there, that is because I first, first hooked the motor up to the original source, so that when you move the arm, or, you know, from stop to play, it stops the turntable. But since the motor ran way too fast and in the wrong direction, um, I reversed the wiring so the motor can run the opposite direction. But it worked, but it still ran at like uh, way faster than it needed to be. So I used, I thought of this power brick that you can change voltages on. And that works for the motor. I just have to use a separate power source to stop to start and stop the turntable. So it's this is pretty much my do whatever you want, bitch turntable. And so I'm just having some fun with it. Obviously, I'm not going to destroy it. I can't do that. Everything else still works just fine because that player is in the radio. So yeah, it's just a uh, having kind of an, an enjoyment. Just tinkering around turntable with a needle that was broken that I replaced, I mean fixed. So yeah. And I, I don't know if you can hear that, but it's running a little bit too fast. But it's funny if I wiggle the wire. Because the wire is just sitting there, it kind of like, I don't know. It doesn't have its full contacts inside so if I move the wire a little bit it will slow it down just a little bit and vice versa so it's just it's just fun to have tinker around with since I'm using it for parts now but it's still good and the 45 and 33 speeds still work because it doesn't require an electric switch it's more of just a gear forcing the belt down on a fatter part of the what do I call it well the shaft I think I think it's a shaft whatever it sticks out of the motor but yeah, so yeah, that's that. Just having fun with an old turntable for parts, and I'm liking it very much. Oh yeah, watching Law and Order in the background. Ha! Huh. Right, I'll see you later.